when I was probably seven years old. My brothers started windsurfing a bit before me. They were quite troublesome kids. It was seen as a way of getting them off the streets and, you know, just doing something. We had no lessons, we just kind of got thrown out there. It was quite a safe environment on the lake. You know, when you're a kid, you, there's so many rules and, I don't know, I suppose when you get on the water, it's just so free. I know people talk a lot about it in sailing, but it's just the freedom, but I think when you're a kid, it's even more so. We went off to the first regatta and we started racing, and then, of course, that's it, you're on the circuit. And then from there, it's kind of fast tracks all the way to kind of world championships when you're 17, 18. And then I suppose by the time you get to about 18, everything becomes uh, possible. Everything was so easy. Everything was so, this is easy. If I can just do these few things, then I can you know, win at the Olympics. And I genuinely thought I could medal. But when you're young, everything's happened so fast and your progression is so fast that you think in a couple of months' time, oh, I'm going to be so much better at this. But of course you're not. It's never windsurfing that keeps me awake at night. That's my, that's the bit I love. The hardest thing about the RSX is it's so difficult to control on the race course. You watch the fleet of lasers start and they all start and they all kind of stay together. They get a bit of a split. You watch the windsurfing start and everyone should go everywhere. I'd say there's six of us that are all capable of winning in Rio. Yeah, it's going to be close. It is really difficult and it's, it's a race course where it is very difficult to, ma to manage that risk because people do separate so much and the current is a little bit tricky but the wind is really tricky and really unstable. I never thought I was going to go to five Olympic Games. I never planned this. You know, I planned to go to one and then I oh, thought, yeah, alright, two. It's China and then London. Can't stop and get your home games. I never wanted to be an old man windsurfing. I wanted to be a respectable businessman. But yeah, here I am, yeah, one more. I'm I'm there, you know, I, I can win now. You know, if we have the Olympic Games now, I could win. Twenty years is a long time. Yeah, it would be amazing. It would be amazing to win a gold medal.